What's up, young, dumb, and abroad? My name is Jack. This is Angelise. We were fortunate enough to go on exchange to Estonia. We're going to tell you guys about some key takeaways and a few funny stories. Yeah, so we went to Tallinn, Estonia, probably the most slept on place in Europe. We can say that after going there, the place was unbelievable. And funny story, actually, if you talk about culture shock, um, first weekend we were there in Estonia, we went on this uh, winter games that they held and it actually uh, was every university in the country met up at one kind of campground and they had a bunch of winter games like like it was the Olympics. So they had like downhill skiing, they had um, different types of skating, ice hockey, and they also had like winter volleyball and stuff. But the craziest thing about it, which really shocked Jack and I, is their main event on the Saturday night was women's mud wrestling. But to give you a little bit of a backstory on what it was like, it was they had one representative, one female from every university. They were in their underwear wrestling in mud. So they would take a shot of ja of Jägermeister, wrestle. <laughs> then go at each other until there was one victor in a legit wrestling thing and the atmosphere here was like nothing you'd ever see in Canada and when me and Jack were watching we were just like what is going on this was absolutely bananas but my key takeaway is although it was a funny story it wouldn't have happened unless I took a risk and just went and tried to do something so the key takeaway is like do whatever you can uh, get a, get yourself out there experiment like you don't you want to leave no stone unturned like just give it your all like have a great time and get cultured well said well said for me i've never been overseas i've never been on a plane overseas and this was my first trip abroad and i was a little bit intimidated at first but when i got there it wasn't so bad but a little funny story within the first week we were getting groceries and i went to this little market and it was full of elderly Estonian women and men. And as soon as I entered the market, everyone kind of just dropped their grocery bags and said, who is this guy? And that was my first sense of culture shock. And my key takeaway is that you're going to experience culture shock at some point. Uh, there's going to be people that are accepting of you and some people that aren't accepting of you. And you just got to find those people that really want to hang out with you and show you a fun time. All the best. Cheers.